everybody, What's Up Wednesday. We're gonna talk about using your iPads or your iPhones with the screen share application that is on your Active Panel version seven. So I'm gonna show you how to do it because the iPad or the Apple series, they got a little trick that you really don't necessarily need the app in order to mirror your screen. So let me show you how that works. So I am going to, I went to my screen share here in your unified menu, down here at the bottom, way down here at the bottom here, okay, right there, and I popped up the number. So I'm already in the screen share, but remember it pops up little and it has that six digit code. So I am going to now, pop in using the iPad. And I'm gonna show you what the iPad looks like once I share. So I am going to be looking for that six digit code. Now, you know, at the top, in the top right of your Apple device, you have like your percentage of battery and you also have um, your Wi-Fi strength. Well, if you swipe down, you're gonna see screen share, screen mirroring. So I'm gonna click that and it's going to find the active panel for you based on that six digit code. So here it is, this, this says Xsize iPad. So I'm gonna click here and I'm gonna hit the share button. So now you're gonna see, this is what it looks like. So let me show you again. So I'm going to just, here is the iPad. So up here at the top, right here at the top, right up here, you have, you know, here is your strength of your Wi-Fi, here's your battery life, you know, those kind of things. Well, if I swipe down with my finger, I'm gonna get to some utility tools. This is what I'm looking for right here. Right now, it's mirroring to the active panel and the active panel ID number, that six digit code, it will say screen mirroring. Now, if you have an a newer version of an Apple device, it probably doesn't say screen mirror. It just might have just these two rectangles there for you. So you really don't necessarily need an app. You really don't necessarily need anything else except for a swipe down. And then you're able to use your iPad almost like a tablet. So if you have an Apple Pencil, you can certainly pull up notes there on the screen, pull up notes and start taking notes with your students, walk around the room. You can use it almost like a whiteboard, if you will. Remember, you can have apps like Jamboard, those kind of things, so that you can use it anywhere in the room. Or your students can too, with just a swipe of a finger. Good luck trying it out, guys. Thanks so much.